If I'm elected, you won't lose one plant. You'll have plants coming into this country. You're going to have jobs again. You won't lose one plant. I promise you that. I promise you. Some rough news for Allegheny County today. The Dresser Ram plant in Wellsville will be closing, leaving hundreds out of work by the time the shutdown is complete. And this all involves a proud piece of Allegheny County's industrial heritage. I started at Dresser Ram in uh, 1986. Outstanding place to work. They treat the employees well. The benefits that they have, I mean, the wages were the best wages in the county, by far, and the benefits were equal. I mean, the benefits, it was just a fantastic place to work. We've been here for over 100 years here at this location, producing steam turbines this entire time. We've made money here at Wellsville pretty much year in and year out, and we're down now to 140-ish bargaining unit employees, and they're all good machinists, and they're all going to lose their job here in the next five to six months. There's nothing wrong with being part of a union. It, it has benefited me greatly for 31 years, greatly. And it's, it's just a tough pill to swallow. It, it makes me feel angry that a company like Siemens can, can uh, purchase some, uh, something like us, uh, which, which has some pretty important duties when it comes to our government work, and just, just tear it apart and shut it down. At first, everybody was just kind of numb, and as it started setting in the reality, the morale is, is, is pretty poor. These employees did not have an opportunity to choose their destiny. They came to work there, they, they learned to trade, they were outstanding at it, and they had their life expectancy really cut out from under them. It's not a fact of, of whether we were making money. It's not, an, it's not a fact of whether uh, our work uh, slowed way down to the point that would cause something like this. Even in this transition where they're closing down Wellsville right now, they're struggling to get our product here from Wellsville, the steam turbine product from Wellsville. They, they're struggling to get that manufactured anywhere, in country or out of country. Now I go through that shop constantly, even as a business rep, I'm in that shop at least once a week. I know a lot of people in there. When you're walking around the facility and people can't even pick their heads up to look at you, they're troubled. As, as uh, the union president at the time, I wrote letters to all of our um, elected officials, uh, including uh, Governor Cuomo. We did everything we could to try to stir up, you know, some interest of, of this facility, how important it is to our community, it just seems to fall upon deaf ears. You're taking millions and millions of dollars out of this economy. This isn't just about the people. This is about this area. You have two grocery stores. Come back in two years. We'll probably be lucky to have one. I, I can't even begin to tell you what our area is going to be like in, in a year or two with the, these good jobs going away. I just don't understand where the accountability is. Why, what, 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 what's up with corporate America? It isn't just this company. It's a number of companies out there.